How's it going guys and welcome back for a brand new video. Today I'm going to be releasing my third console client and this right here works with every single version you could possibly imagine and even if you have a Mojang account, if you have a Microsoft account, we're gonna get through absolutely everything. The setup that you have installed, which you should have on your PC right now, should look something like this. However, if you don't have the books on the picture, go ahead and download Winrow. You can also find that down in the description. But alright, today you have downloaded the Microsoft version of a console client. I do have a guide inside this so if you go ahead and click on this right here go ahead and drag it out to the desktop so now you have this right there go ahead and open that up and you can see I have a guide right here that pretty much explains everything that you need to worry about so how to change it from Mojang account to Microsoft account how to change the frequency of certain commands absolutely everything that you need is right here but all right before we get into anything how do you add accounts to the console client all you have to do is right click on the AFK bat and click on edit and you're gonna see something like this you have to change this side here out with either the account if you're of course having a Mojang account if you do you do need to make some additional changes so go ahead and check out the guide in the folder and obviously the password and the IP for Microsoft accounts enter your email password and IP and you're good to go if you want to go ahead and add more than one account all you have to do is copy this right here and put it down below and you can add as many as you want once you have done that all you have to do is click on the AFK bat and it's going to start something up like this then this right here is going to close down and you're going to get an additional console client right there and if you go ahead and open that up it has already logged on and it's pretty much ready to run as you can see i'm already running a few scripts right here sent server factions you can change that and obviously it's going to respawn itself every so often this right here is something that i set up for you guys so it's going to be a lot easier for you guys to pretty much just install it and get going right away if you want to change what it says so you see it says server factions right there if you want to change that click on the room select and change this right here out with whatever you want this idea is going to be sent the second you lock it on a server and every so often after that so this right here is obviously going to be join skyblog or hop or something like that that you wanted to do on a lock-in the next one is respawn all this right here is is pretty much just telling the server or sorry telling your account to respawn in case that it die but as i said absolutely everything can be found in my document right here and how you change well pretty much anything there's also a lot more things you can do with console clients so if you're interested in any other things like dropping something in your inventory making the account move and so on and so on we can go ahead and do that as well now this right here is the account in game and as you can see it is actually working perfectly if you go ahead and open up the console client though i just want to verify that it is actually in game so if you do asd you can see that asd down in the chat and obviously if i go ahead and kill the account let's go ahead and kill it right there it is going to automatically respawn whenever this script right here is run this is about every i'm pretty sure it's every minute or so so let's go ahead and make this one here count a little bit and it should probably respawn within 38 seconds obviously you can change all of these settings to make it spawn faster if you wanted to all of that can obviously be found in my guide as well and there we are it respawned and it's ready to go once again you can go ahead and make this go to its home if it died as well there's a lot of other things you can do so leave a comment if you really want me to make another version a more complicated version but there you are that is pretty much it thank you guys so much for watching Thing and see you guys next video. Yes, my alt can do that as well.